Ladies and gentlemen, this will be an energetic and fun talk as he is specialized in the fitness industry and he owns his own unique training methods while helping individuals achieve their physical target and leading them into a healthy lifestyle. He is distinguished by his practical style in training, highly caring towards his clients and with him nothing but results, yet of course with hard work. Lloyd Parks speaks to us about his fitness career, but let's watch this video first. And ladies and gentlemen, we are here tonight with the one and only Lloyd Parks. Good evening, how are you? Good evening, thank you for having me. Very good, thank you. Oh, definitely. We are super excited to have you here. So how you been? What's been going on? Uh, yeah, things are great. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. All's, all's going well. Uh, new chapters recently. Mm. Um, so working in a new position at a new gym now, uh, okay. which is nice. Always a uh, good change. And, awesome. you know, yeah, yeah. Awesome. So things are very good, thanks. Yeah. I mean, ever since we met up a long time ago in different events, your energy is just so evident you know it's like Thank oh you. my god he comes Lloyd you know he's gonna lift up <laughs> the entire spirit right here so it's good to see you again and your Thank energy you is much. so evident right here even yes. on the show thank you so much thank you so for those who don't know you much yeah. how long you've been here in Bahrain um, so I actually came out here in uh, 97 with my parents so, wow. so about almost 24 years apart from university back in England so amazing, yeah, amazing. Yeah, yeah. you're Bahraini man <laughs> pretty much yes yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what everyone tells me so <laughs> so with all that when did you enter the fitness industry um, so I actually so I never intended to be in fitness okay uh, I grew up here I was in school uh, at St. Chris and right. then uh, I went back to the UK for a business management degree okay. and then I came back out started working here did maybe three or four years um, in your sort of office jobs project management okay. business development and then um, yeah it wasn't going the speed that I wanted mm. and, and uh, I joined a gym at the time and I realized that I wanted to be on my feet and they okay. offered me an opportunity to, to cross over into, into uh, fitness management huh. and take on both roles as a, as a PT and in management. So, so yeah, so it was an opportunity I decided to, to jump on board, yeah. Wasn't that a bit too much, you know, being you know, in the administration it's sites and yet again a trainer? It's, uh, yeah, it's a funny thing. Uh, it's, you know, because I, I want to keep my, keep my hand in both. Okay. Cause, uh, because that's what I really, you know, specialize in with skill wise. Um, but then now this is really my passion as well. So it's, you know, it becomes overwhelming mm. because you're using body and brain a lot of the time from a strategy <laughs> point of view, you know, and awesome. then out on, uh, out awesome. on the floor. But, um, but yeah, no, it's, it's, uh, it's good. It's rewarding. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, what kind of fitness you're into right now? So I would say uh, my specialism is a lot to do with high intensity workouts, mm. um, but mixing that up with strength, 
um, plyometrics. Uh, I think if they've seen the video already, so doing wow. sort of like you know your Superman push-ups, human flags. Um, uh, so yeah, so I like to mix it up: body weight, strength. Okay. Um, kettlebells. Uh, okay. I, I don't like to be a one-trick pony. It's, it's, you know, okay. Right <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, speaking of Superman, all the crazy moves, we saw a video, you know, pretty much doing your Superman push-ups around the world. Yep. So how about right now to go to the audience and see that video together? Let's go. Okay, whoa, whoa, from the airport to the States, yep. to Miami, to New York, I, I can't even do one. <laughs> so what do you call this workout? Uh, so, I mean, this is more, I guess it's one of those sort of uh, rewarding movements. It's more of a show off movement than, than anything, <laughs> okay. if I'm honest, um, but something for the gram. Um, okay. So, you know, just trying to tack a bit of interest and, and uh, yeah, I was in the east on the east coast of the the states uh, just okay. in the summer. So right. so yeah, so I was trying to bridge together the movements and put a little video together and yeah 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 boost, boost up my following and yeah. Well, this is major fun. I mean, it's like again, not only me but even some of the clients that I know and people that have been around you, they all have fun just being around you in the yeah, vicinity you, yeah. of Lloyd. It's like, okay, now we're gonna have some good energy. We're gonna have a lot of positivity. Let's go. It's su yeah, super important. Um, I think, you know, it's having that fun element. You know, we all right. work a lot. We're, you know, we're busy all day. So it's when people are getting in the gym, if you're not having fun, then you're probably doing the wrong thing. And mm. you know, that's why I like to mix it up. You know, body weight into kettlebells, some, some, and then some of these Superman push-ups. <laughs> you know? <laughs> awesome, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's major fun. So now, you have your own unique style. Yep. You started a new chapter. Tell us more about that. Yeah, so uh, I'm now working with a new gym in uh, Hamela. There's a new complex, uh, Al Lawan. Okay, uh, yes. If I say everything yes. no, you correctly. Got it right. You got yeah, yeah, one. yeah, yeah. You got it right. <laughs> um, and it's uh, it's a mega gym. I, I believe it's somewhere between two to three thousand square meters, and you know they got everything. And it's uh, brand new equipment out from the states and the UK. So um, this is great for me. It's uh, obviously great for Bahrain as well, and, and they were already established here, so it's an expansion on their business. Um, but it's a great platform because they've, you know, they've got a wide range of, of applications that I can use and mixing up my style and, and right. ultimately delivering that to, to, to the population and the people that I get to meet. So everything Amazing. from classes to personal training. Amazing. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. how do you see yourself training people? What kind of style do you have? Um, so, you know, it, it depends. I, I see people in different capacities okay. um, and I train with different levels of people as well. So right. we, I've got just with general, uh, general population for classes, and a lot of that is about having um, a genuine amount of fun and enjoying it as well. Uh, but also equally is trying to challenge people. Um, okay. So it's all about the smiles at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. um, but equally, if, you know, if there's no complaints, then there's probably something going wrong. Um, <laughs> <so laughs> <laughs> 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 Got to hear some wrong. feedback, you know. Um, wow. so, so yeah, so and then on personal training front, as I say, you know, some people are very, uh, very fitness focused, or they're very goal orientated, and, and you know that can come with a much more serious uh, program. Whereas some people want to take it, and you know everyone's starting at different points in their lives or their fitness journey. So some people it's first just losing weight, and then with some people we're really looking on packing on muscle, and mm. they're really counting their calories, and they're you know they're very uh, everything's very targeted and goal oriented. Right. You know, so right. so yeah, so you know it's it's playing the field if you like as to, to the okay. different goals and okay. yeah. yeah. Now. Um, as you've been in the fitness industry for such a while right mm. now, how would you describe the fitness industry here in Bahrain? It's, um, it's an interesting question because I've been here for so long, um, you know, you have really seen it evolve. Right. Uh, back when I, was, when I was younger, there was uh, no boxing clubs in Bahrain, right. for example. And, you know, just that sort of uh, evolution in the fitness industry from, from a culture perspective, uh, right the way through to the availability on, on the market. Right. Um, 
And I think Corona as of recent has had a real big effect on that because people are just, their health conscious, consciousness and their awareness is so mm. much higher now. Mm. Um, because when we're all locked down and we had restrictions, you suddenly realize, well, I'd love to go out for a walk. Yeah. Or if I could do anything yeah. to go for a run. And, you know, and they realize how important it is to, you know, to have that healthy balance and eat well. And, you know, and I think that's, um, that's really changed right. the market dynamics. And you, know, you can see that in gyms now. It's not just New mm. Year's. It's an, all round <laughs> <laughs> it's an all round sort of perspective. Amazing. Which is good. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I got to say, man, I really appreciate what you've done during the Corona times, like, you know, receiving all those videos, receiving all those calls, receiving all those messages on WhatsApp. It's like, hey, we're ready for a live session right now. Get together. And, you know, when things kind of opened up, you were so careful with the precautionary measures yes. to make sure yeah, everybody yeah. knows social distancing and all that. You were very much on details and on par with everything. Yeah, so I just want to say thank you so much. I mean, not only me, even everybody else who've been receiving the same message. Yeah. <laughs> <from> <laughs> it's like, hey, dude, he's really into it. I'm like, dude he w needs to get us moving yeah yeah, yeah yeah keeping us all together making sure that we're okay so that's amazing i Thank mean you. that shows really you really care about everybody well i mean it's you know the the fitness is um it's uh, it's the psychological safety of it as well and that wasn't just in corona but that was so evident in corona is that people want to come in and they wanted that safe space for their family and for themselves and, and okay. you know but that relates right the way down to training every day okay. it's uh, you know you first realize it's it's about the you know it's the physical aspect, but right. so much of it's mental as well. Amazing. Um, so yeah, so yeah, it's, it's great to deliver. Yeah, thank you. So what is uh, what is the future like? Oh, it's going to look like for the awesome Lloyd. <laughs> thank you very much. Um, well, at the moment, I'm really working into a lot of online training. Okay. Um, I'm trying to brand myself uh, as you know as a singular trainer person and get myself out there as much as possible. Um, I've got some big plans, hopefully for 2022. Um, not going to say too much at this point because okay, yeah, well, I like, you know, keeping against Caesar. Like to, yeah, I like to get it out there and then share it. But you know, maybe something in Bahrain of, of my own where I can, okay. you know. But, but let's see, let's see how let's see how it goes. Well, yeah. can't wait to yeah. join you with that, definitely. Thank you. Yeah. Well, Lloyd, any last words to your viewers? Um, just you know, thank you so much for supporting me. I Pleasure. can't do it without without the clients. Um, and you know, keep up the hard work on everybody's sake. And if there's anything I can do, then please get in touch on, on Instagram or, or just come in and, and find me. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. Well, awesome Lloyd. Thank you so much for being with us right here on Bahrain Now. It's been a great pleasure. Thank you for having me. Thank Definitely. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, a new chapter with Lloyd and pretty much we're going to see a lot happening with him. All that took place with an interview right here on Bahrain Now.